crazy. Pugna is a very smart little skeleton. But he's still the butler, so yep. kind of weird at Skeeter. Getting gone on. Nice flame break, but the last right click is there from save. They calculate. Nightfall has been bullied quite heavily by Amar. And GPK makes his first comes. rotation. Focus fires there. Amar trying to fight his way through it. Static link onto GPK. But the waveform from Nightfall into the adaptive leads to the But yeah, this, uh, this rotation from GPK obviously does cost somewhere. Malreen will get the space in mid and find a lot of farm. Oh. But it was important oh. to get Morphling online oh. there. GPK, Onslaught's coming for you. Connects. Not even needing to pulverize. Big kill from Malreen. Surprised he didn't even try to move when he heard it. Yeah. He just stood there and accepted his fate. Maybe he does. Maybe they need to pause for their headphones. The Snake King trying to get to the high ground. The Centaur Stampede almost saves him. Ends up dropping to save who dies right afterwards. And that <laughs> a very elongated double kill from Maureen. To steal stuff away from the enemy carry. Now he's going to farm his top area as well. So very they're more patient points. from Bet Boom. They were waiting for this Razor to show up. Amar's going to get some help from Crit, though. Is it going to be enough? It might be. No. He does fall, but two supports from Ben oh, get taken out. Him. Barely the Onslaught reaches Nightfall, and now the God Strength will be put to the test. Nightfall now on the run. There's the slow from the stolen power shot. And the Flame Break back into the fray he comes. Double kill for Crit of all heroes. Oh, yeah, great super, response. super close. Uh, Betbo messed that up a little bit, I think. They used Decrepify on the Pugna, uh, so Morph couldn't attack. But then they didn't use the Decrepify to adaptive him. So it was a little bit... Uh, Betbo trying to turn this around now as Malreen. Oh, Onslaught will get canceled by the Frostbite. Amar showing up again. As Malreen looks like he's running away. There's the last one to GPK, but no follow-up for snaking Amar. Does come in for the plasma field, trying to finish off Toronto Tokyo, but the butler is there to save him a bit. But save now. We'll have to run away in shame or just go to the grave itself. Using a nice drain though onto Amar. It matters not though. Double kill for Skeeter, who's getting very much. And we'll be going for the Manta. He's in trouble. This BKB is going to be forced to the bare minimum. Oh, he's in the low ground though, so he can't react in time. He's dead. Falcons are getting picked apart. Step by step, Bet Boom with. Falcons will get the bigger one. Bet Boom. Oh, I'm looking for a 4v5 here. Primal Beast is top, and he will be showing on the wave, so effectively a 4v4 if Falcons get caught. Amar. Amar caught off guard again. So quick burst. Bet Boom have been on top of things this game in terms of just finding pickoffs. Yeah. Still behind in net worth, but the fact that it hasn't really gotten worse than. I mean, it was like 8k at some point, so... Oh, another pickoff! Yep, snaking! Not Done duration, so. Like, between I mean, Lasso and Pulverize alone. It, it is amazing, this game, so I totally get why he bought it. It's not like it's shocking, but just a... I, did, I didn't think most morphs buy this, but in this game, it's too good. All right, Roche, not up for another minute and a half as Malreen trying to disrupt things. They get the Lincolns proc'd, and my god, GP, GPK gets destroyed. And Toronto, Tokyo in the corner of the map with the freezing field. Pretty tanky, but not enough to survive here. Activate on nothing. That sound effect is nice, though. Yeah, it's a good shard now. I like that. Falcons looking for the backstab. Yep. Should be kind of expected. Toronto, Tokyo in the trees is going to be spotted first. The pulverize is there. Stormhammer. Oh, uh, uh, that, Skeeter, a little oh, bit of awkward, awkward fight. They do get him in the end, though. And you can see Amar <laughs> convulsing. As he pops the BKB and tries to run as Nightfall was being dragged like a dog. And you can see the lasso come through as Skeeter just rips through save. Nightfall again being static linked. And Amar, they're going to be able to clean things up really easily. This was not even close. Falcons full team wipe. The high ground attempt from Malreen. As the pulverizes there, was instantly cancelled. You can see Miero kind of in no man's land. Crit, despite being very tanky, actually will live as a result of being that tanky. Very nicely done. Miero stuck on the cliff and left all alone. That'll be the death of the center. That's a full minute on the deck. And save. The TP will be fine. 
Skinner was jumping on the puck now. He should have died instantly, but he managed to somehow create distance after the stun connected. Oh, Mallory going in pretty deep, gets the pulverize onto the CM. Toronto Tokyo getting healed up by save. As Amar goes in even deeper, still has the Aegis, of course. Gale Force making things a little bit awkward, but now the Gale Force is stolen. <laughs> That's a great steal. And now the fortification comes out. Malreen still trying to create space here as finally the CM. No, the Decrepify keeps them alive a little bit longer as Snake King gets the lasso, but the attribute shift was there from the Morphling. So Nightfall was going to survive. Finally, Toronto Tokyo dies, but he does have buyback. And save with the Ogus here told him that that's definitely not English. Either way, he dies. Telekinesis. Amar. Still trying to use this Gale Force to their advantage. I think they're on top of each other, in fact. Oh and my Spank god. Peter heals up to full, destroys Miero. No buyback for him as Nightfall also getting gone on. That's the death of him. Triple kill for Skeeter. Toronto Tokyo is going to make it an ultra. And now. The GG's come out as Falcons will take My game number one. Goodness. Falcons versus Bet Boom, game two. Just in time for the pause, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Welcome. Suns fan here with Cinderin. And things just go wrong, right? It's not always doing great. Yeah, not always. As Nightfall is getting burned by Crit. Fairy nice Fire torrent. pops Torrent from Amar. First blood, Crit. Now, Toronto Tokyo does have the three leaps, and it doesn't matter. <laughs> the Tidebringer from Amar will snipe him. Which has not seemed to be a problem for Falcons so far in this tournament, to be fair. It's been very much on point. QPK. Rain. Oh, Static dear. Link. He already used his banish. The OD. That'll be the death of GPK. Malreen takes it for himself. Of course, kind of an old-school counter to OD. As he's going to go high ground and find himself a little Toronto Tokyo action, riding on his little bunny rabbit. He'll be forced oh. to use all his leaps. Okay. Get out with just a sliver of oh, HP. And then, what's your combo? Centaur, Tiny Mirana, like maybe? Malrain had an idea that someone something was coming for him. And it will be got this one. the four members of Bet Boom. It's a good kill, which is going to give them some momentum on the mid tower. This timing is particularly good at minute 10, so... Well planned out. See if Falcons even try to defend this tower at all. Or if they're just going to keep turning this into farming time. Well, they will these defend. TPs are coming. Amar with the X. Torrent connects onto the OD. Flame break back into the boat as well. Will also proc GPK. He's going to heal up a decent amount, but now gets frostbitten into the lasso and even a freezing field. As Amar has his blade melt in tow. And I would assume it's just the old Aghanim Scepter afterwards. He's already halfway if he wants to go for it. Lasso finds its target into the Frostbite. Freezing field. Stampede won't. Okay, Toronto, Tokyo. First to fall. Will be a trade, though, for Snaking. So one for one. But the X onto the OD. GPK dead. Double kill for Malreen. Oh, my God. And they're God. not done yet. Save going to be the next. Did Skitter just find Miero, a Potentially the fourth. Skeeter, I assume, got the double concoction. Yeah, I think he got a double concoction off off camera there. Oh boy. Radiance Middle Tower is under attack. Miero, um, save is in the trees. Going to get the Avatos onto Crit. Not enough for the kill. As Crit gets to the high ground, flame break and save just slow to an absolute crawl. Stampede, but an instant frostbite from Snake King. Miero, counter initiation does find a pick off onto Crit. Looks like they can't get the vision. Taunt away, taunt away. Good stuff. Skeeter. Concoction. They don't layer it properly as Crit's actually getting taken down by the illusions. Down he goes. There's the BKB pop to force, or to not allow Nightfall to get off the Sunder, and that leads to his ultimate demise. He is now building up an eggs. Oh, I can't wait. Probably going to just put on, I would imagine, well, Malreen would make sense to some degree, but it's not like the Refresher Ags build is safe. Going for the initiation, Miero not hitting the hoof stomp at all. They do pick off the Bat Rider, who buys back instantly. Malreen now with his BKB. Focus is on the TB. He's dead. Save will be next. Double kill for Amar. As the Boots of Travel 2 being used by Skeeter to join this fight. He's going to get the Abyssal Blade onto Miero. Gets off the hoof stomp, but completely surrounded and will eventually be brought down as well. So they get the one kill. 
Okay, oh, this is a good move from Bed Boom. If it gets punished here, this could just be the end of the game. And Amar, Torrent, oh, dear. Boat is coming as well. Miero has to TP out with the BKB. He's actually going to cancel it as GPK gets caught out. He's dead for 60. And that is a huge punishment as Roche is not interested in this fight at all. Nightfall surrounded, bashed, and killed. Well, it could have been a good play. I, I think you do need to do something yeah. to this effect. I mean, sure. You, you got to take a risk, but Falcons were ready for it. And Falcons will force out. Well, Miro might, might live, actually. Probably the GG here. <laughs> and they yeah. finally do call it as the Tier 4s are getting hit. So Falcons remain undefeated in this group stage number two. And